Sustainability of Wet Rice Farming for Local Communities Rice cultivation is a critical source of livelihood and food security for millions of people around the world, particularly in Asia where it is a staple crop. However, rice cultivation can also have negative social, economic, and environmental impacts, particularly when it is not managed in a sustainable manner. In this essay, we will discuss the sustainability of rice cultivation and its impacts on local communities. Sustainable rice cultivation involves the use of practices that promote environmental conservation, social equity, and economic viability. These practices include the use of organic and integrated pest management techniques, the promotion of biodiversity, the conservation of water and soil resources, and the adoption of climate-smart agricultural practices. Sustainable rice cultivation can help to reduce the negative impacts of rice production and promote the long-term viability of rice farming as a source of livelihood and food security. One of the key benefits of sustainable rice cultivation is its positive impact on the environment. Sustainable rice cultivation practices can help to reduce the negative environmental impacts of rice production, such as soil erosion, water pollution, and greenhouse gas emissions. For example, the use of organic and integrated pest management techniques can help to reduce the use of harmful pesticides and fertilizers. While the promotion of biodiversity can help to enhance natural pest control and reduce the impact of pests and diseases on rice crops. Sustainable rice cultivation practices can also help to promote soil health and water conservation, which can improve the long-term viability of rice farming. Another important benefit of sustainable rice cultivation is its positive impact on local communities. Sustainable rice cultivation practices can help to promote social equity by providing opportunities for small-scale farmers and enhancing their access to markets and resources. Sustainable rice cultivation can also help to promote food security by ensuring the availability of nutritious and affordable food for local communities. In addition, Sustainable rice cultivation can help to promote cultural diversity and preserve traditional knowledge and practices related to rice cultivation. However, the adoption of sustainable rice cultivation practices also faces significant challenges. Particularly in developing countries where small-scale farmers often lack the resources, knowledge, and infrastructure needed to implement these practices. In addition, the globalization of the rice industry and the increasing demand for high-yielding rice. Varieties can create pressure on farmers to adopt unsustainable practices that prioritize short-term productivity over long-term sustainability. To address these challenges, it is important to promote the development of effective policies and programs that support sustainable rice cultivation practices and empower small-scale farmers. This can include the development of agroecological and participatory approaches to rice cultivation. The provision of technical assistance and training to farmers, the establishment of certification programs that promote sustainable rice cultivation practices. and the implementation of policies that support small-scale farmers and promote sustainable and equitable rice production and trade practices. Another important aspect of sustainable rice cultivation is the preservation of cultural heritage and traditional knowledge. Rice cultivation is deeply embedded in the cultural heritage of many societies, and traditional knowledge and practices related to rice cultivation have been developed and refined over centuries. 
However, the modernization and industrialization of agriculture have led to the decline of traditional rice cultivation practices and the loss of biodiversity and cultural diversity. To address this challenge, it is important to promote the conservation and revitalization of traditional rice cultivation practices and the preservation of cultural heritage. This can include the development of participatory and community